the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Hello and welcome. The floodlights are shining down here at the 80,000 capacity Blue Sail Stadium just to the north of Doha. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and sitting alongside me the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Spain versus Germany. Well, thanks Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Here's the lineup for Spain. Cabajal starts with Jordi Alba in the fullback positions. Danny Olmo plays with Ferran Torres out wide. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer gets the nod in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Niklas Zule at the back. Ilkay Gundogan plays with Leon Goretzka in the center of midfield. And the focal point in attack is Thomas Müller. And the match begins. Muller just cutting off the supply. Pau Torres. Gabi. Here's Carvajal. And slipped through beautifully. Well, he couldn't keep himself onside. Well, he just delayed the pass, didn't he? That was a great opportunity. Gundogan. David Raum. Gnabry. What's he going to do here? Müller. Really intense pressure applied. Carvajal. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out the situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, the marking was tight. The header off target in the end. And foul it is then. Possession given away. 
Serge Gnabry. It's with Gundogan. Muna distributing magnificently. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Well, between 2008 and 2012, Spain were right oh, up. Derek, big moment here. Still possibilities. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Firing it in. Just made sure nothing came of that. And space to cross it. Müller. Germany could get in behind the defence. Gnabry. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. And played short. Gnabry. Well, they couldn't make anything of that cross with the ball in a decent enough position. Well, there to intercept. Decent position for Germany to be in. Oh, good vision. That is really alert defending just when the situation looked dangerous. Now, potential danger. Gnabry. Gnabry with it. They've got it now. What can they do? Marco Asensio. An unforced error, you've got to say. And a good-looking ball. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Serge Gnabry. A move of promise on the flank. Might it be Marco Asensio? Well, the keeper had to concentrate. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. David Raum. Out of play for a Spain throw in. Pau Torres. Really getting stuck in. Oh, a vital interception. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? All in all, a broken counter-attack. Leon Goretzka. Nicely timed tackle. And the attack fades out. Leroy Zane. Determined defending. And this might not be the ideal situation for them. And there it is, the breakthrough. That will do nicely. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Torres. Throw in then for Germany. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass.
Marco Asensio. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Really closing him down. Asensio. Sergio Busquets. Cabajal. Crossing into the middle. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Well, as those stats tell us, Germany have been second best in terms of possession. But their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. Breaking at pace. Goretzka. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Carvajal. Played in there by Danny Carvajal. Well, threat averted. And Spain regaining possession. Good technique displayed. Can he put it away here? Safe pair of hands, did his job. Müller. Zane has it. Musiala. Müller. Will he finish? Off the post and back in play. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Well, had that gone in, they would be in complete control of this game. As it is, they're still going to be a bit nervy. Yes, in possession again, and maybe another opportunity developing here. Nicely cut out. Gnabry. Careless in possession. Musiala. Raum. Gnabry with it. Good move in the making from Germany. What's he going to do here? Müller. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. And taken short. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So, underway again. And a 2-0 advantage here. <laughs> Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Now, what can they do from here? Well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. Can he find the right pass? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, really, it had to be further away from the keeper. And there it is, the half-time whistle.
So back underway here into the second half. Gundogan. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Gundogan. And a good take under duress there. Sergio Busquets. Pedri. An unforced error, you've got to say. In it goes! And I'll tell you what, the goalkeeper is wishing quite simply he hadn't done that. Well, here's the replay, and as you can see, he doesn't read the danger at all, does he? It's a poor piece of goalkeeping. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. And space for Germany in the wide area. Element of risk there. Müller! Goalkeeper dealt with it. Going short. Goretzka. Oh, a smart stop. Well smuggled behind for another corner. Delivering it. And the degree of difficulty wasn't all that high in terms of the save. Pau Torres. It's with Laporte. Gabi. Germany with the ball once again. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Can they keep it going? And it might be. Well, getting in the way. Superb save. How about the short corner? Makes his way in field. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Sané. And return to Muna. What a shocking pass, really. progress oh he's got himself in hot water well no card just a warning and Stuart you're furrowing your brow well he's got away with that one he hasn't even got a yellow card that's a very strange decision I would say he's lost it and will it be the leveler and he finds the net he could hardly miss Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. Serge Gnabry. Germany in a position of menace. And in with a real chance. Side. How marginal was that? But the flag is raised. Jordi Alba. A very effective clearance. Thomas Müller. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, it fizzled out. Gundogan. On a pass that lacks quality.
Gavi. Pedri. On attacking possibilities. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Serge Gnabry. Jamal Musiala. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. He's using his strength to good effect. A good and fair challenge. Well, the attack just lost its momentum, and the keeper will collect. Pedri. Breaking at pace. Given away by Ilkay Gundogan. Jamal Musiala. And Germany exploiting the space on the flank. And let's give credit to the defending. Ferran Torres. Can he do it? Well, that is going to go down as an own goal by the keeper. Well, as the replay shows us, that will be classed as an own goal. He's a bit unlucky there. Well, the action underway once more. And no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Leon Goretzka. Kimmich. In the right place to cut out the pass. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw in. Into the final 20 minutes. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Just had to look a bit lively given the pressure. Laporte. Pedri. It's with Laporte. Fine sequence of passes. Pedri. Jordi Alba. Pedri. Promising attack this. Marco Asensio's in the thick of things. Oh, heading it narrowly over the top. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Rudiger. Leon Goretzka. Here's Fulkrug. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Asensio well able to close down the short and a foul in the opinion of the referee now what can they do from this free kick situation But the keeper able to turn us away. A stunning stop. And over comes the corner. Well, the danger is still there. What a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Well, they've decided to make a change. Phil Krug. Now, 
far from a smooth challenge. Uh, will the referee produce a card? And yellow it is. A booking? Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. Jordi Alba. And return to Koke. Sarabia. On to Jordi Alba. And an attempt best forgotten, I think. Joshua Kimmich. Goretzka has it now. Well, still time for them to level it. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. This could be the equaliser. Brilliant. Goretzka! Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Not increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Going short. A fine block. Well, a short corner here. And Germany get the throw. Oh, he's given it away. Can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Good, sir. Offside by a fraction. But it comes down to the final five minutes. Koke. It's with Carlos Soler. He's got to score! And the keeper got there. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. <laughs> Didn't quite go to plan. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Sergio Busquets. And he's beaten him here. Soler. It's with Laporte. Sergio Busquets. Precise ball movement. Carvajal and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end and a substitution in the offing Sergio Busquets he read the situation defensively and did his job this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Habits. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. But if you make your move too early, you're always in danger of being ruled offside. Okay. Now Busquets. Carvajal.
And there it is, the final whistle. Just what Spain were hoping for. They have delivered a victory, Stuart. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just a 